Um, oh, one thing we can do, we can look at our inventory items, as you can see. Uh, yeah, inventory. can click on here. Ooh, how beautiful. You can also look at the handkerchief. Notebook and pencil. However, even though we have a notebook and pencil, we can't actually read our notebook. You open your notebook and skim through your many notes and observations. Well, thank you. That was very helpful. Um, oh, yeah. I want to get into the cellar. I don't think I can, but I can try. You try opening the cellar, but alas, it is locked. Okay. What can I do then? I could wander around outside, but I'm afraid that if I do that, the clock's going to strike. I did a few practice runs before recording this game, and every once in a while I just walk somewhere and the clock would chime and nothing would happen. So, yeah, I'm kind of afraid to wander around. You know how they all are. It'll be fine, Missy Lily, and you see. Yeah, I changed my mind. I'm going to enter a room a different way. Sometimes it's a little bit shorter. So, go to the left. And even though there's water right there, uh, it miraculously disappears. This is the southeast corner of the mansion right outside the parlor. Great! We want to go in the parlor. You know, Polly, you really understand me, don't ya? Ah, Polly, ah! Unfortunately, I cannot do parrot voices. I am sorry. Talk to Ethel. Ethel is more interested in the parrot. She doesn't seem to notice you. Um, look, Ethel. Oh, we did that. Ethel sits at the bar and, as usual, is hitting the booze. She seems to be talking an inordinate. Uh, she seems to be taking an inordinate interest in the parrot. Ask Ethel about Lillian. Huh? Show Hanky to Ethel. Ethel doesn't even. Okay, well. <laughs> Potty want a cracker? <laughs> ah, cracker? Hick. Okay, well. As weird as the sounds, we're going to go eavesdrop on. Ethel and Polly's conversation. So, without further ado, no, I shouldn't type and talk. It's dangerous. Oh, no music this time. Okay. You know how she all feel about me, don't you, Polly? Well, I don't care what she think, especially Gertie and that conniving daughter of hers. I think I'll have another drink. Okay, Polly? Have a drink, Ark! Cheers to ya! Well, that was fun. Okay. Now I believe there's something going on outside to our left. Oh, that is not outside. Um, Wilbur's not here anymore, but we will soon find him. As soon as we make our way across the house. Go faster! Here we go. <clears throat> you are standing at the northwest corner of the house, right outside the colonel's study. I can't go on with this any longer. I must tell him about... Quiet! Let's go into the house to continue this discussion. 
let's follow them. No privacy here either. We can do this all day. Come on, let's go to the dining room. Let's go. Okay, well, now that they're in the dining room, as you may guess, more spying. By the way, this game is more than just spying, but most of the stuff we need to listen to is at the beginning, so that it just seems like that's all there is to this game. But there isn't, I promise. Look. Holes. It's just not right. We've got to tell them about it. No, it'll work out, Wilbur. I've got some plans. How are we going to replace that hundred grand we took from Henri? Where would you get that kind of money? I know people. I can do it. Trust me. Why would we be so stupid as to bind to a racehorse anyway? And to use Henri's money? We should have known better. Hmm. It would have worked out, Wilbur. It wasn't our fault that... And money pound at the horse broke his leg. All I can say, there is that you better do something fast. Because if you don't, I'm fixing up. I'll handle it, Wilbur. Just don't be stupid and say something. I've got to go. Remember, don't say nothing. There he goes. Okay. And now... I think I have to avoid that room and that room. And I need to go upstairs. To Fifi's room. We haven't been up there yet, I don't think. No, no, we're going to... Rudy's room. That's right. Okay. Which is here. Ooh. This appears to be another guest room that Rudy and Clarence are sharing. What? Oh god. <laughs> Leave me alone, you, you cat. Go Fifi. Hmm.